All right, for this problem, we're going to complete the square. Uh, so I'm going to add one to each side. And then, um, so I get 2x squared minus 3x is equal to 1. All right, so then I'm going to factor out a 2 here. So I get x squared minus 3 halves x. And then I'm going to take half of this, which is 3 over 4, and then square that. So 3 over 4, so that becomes plus 9 over 16, and then I multiply this times 2, so I get 18 over 16, so it's 1 plus 18 over 16. So I get 2 quantity x minus uh, 3 over 4 squared is equal to 18 over 16, which is 16 plus 18, which ends up being, oh heck, 16 plus 18. 34, it should be 34. Serious mental math there, okay. Uh, divide three by two, so times one half. Then we get x minus three to the fourth squared is equal to um, 34 over 32. So this reduces down to 17 over 16. All right, so continuing on. Um, x minus 3 over 4 squared is equal to 17 over 16. I take square root of both sides. I get x minus 3 over 4 is equal to plus or minus the square root of 17 over 4. So I'm going to add 3 fourths to both sides. That's 3 over 4. Finally, we get our solution, which is x is going to be equal to, they have the same common denominator. Um, I'll just put 3 in front. It doesn't matter, though. 3 plus or minus the square root of 17 all over 4. So this is two solutions because you got the plus or minus there. All right, that's it. That is the solution. Hope this helps.